Alright guys, thanks for watching this uh, video here. Right now we have the CarSoft MI6 diagnostic kit and we are currently diagnosing a Honda 2005 model. Uh, the purpose of the video is just to basically show you that the CarSoft MI6 kit uh, diagnosing the different systems on the Honda vehicle here so uh, what we'll do is we'll just touch the screen to start there as you can see it's, uh, it's an easy to use touch screen diagnostic scan tool uh, so we want to be in the Asian option we want to click Honda which is right there we'll just click on the latest software build and what it's going to do now is give us all the different options for the Honda uh, diagnostic menu right so it's asking us first of all USA or Canada or general well, we're just going to click general because we're in Europe here and we're going in the 16 pin data link connector so it's just connecting with the vehicle as we speak now There we go, it's recognised that it is a Honda Jazz. It's got the engine ID as well. So, here is our diagnostic menu. And PGMI FI is the engine. Automatic transmission, ABS, which is the anti-lock braking system. SRS, which is the airbag system. And then, as you can see here, lots of other systems as well. We can scroll through them all. It does give you lots of options. Um, so since we're here first of all we'll just work our way through we'll go to the engine module first of all see if we can find any faults for that Right, okay, so first of all we can read trouble codes and read current. There we go, good news is there's no trouble codes there. And then it gives us lots of other options. Uh, also di read data stream as well, so when the engine's running it'll give us lots of different uh, graphing information and also sort of um, numerical information as well. Um, I'll go and have a look at the. Oh, sorry. I've clicked on the automatic transmission. We'll probably get a fault of this here because uh, we don't actually have automatic transmission in this vehicle. It is a manual vehicle. So it may well come back with a fault once we get to the end of this. Then once we've got past this section, we'll go on and have a look at the uh, ABS section and then also the SRS airbags. Those are the main systems within the vehicles, but obviously there are a lot more systems which can be diagnosed as well. Right, I'll just go back in there to general 16 pin. Right, so we're going to go into the ABS menu now. And it will communicate with this module and tell us if there are any fault codes within the ABS module. We haven't got any ABS light on, 
uh, or we haven't got an, an airbag light on either. Um, it's just, as I say, the purpose of the video is just really to show you that it can communicate with all of these different systems and all of the different vehicles really. Uh, right now we're working on a Honda so we thought why not um, show you that it will work on a Honda as well. Okay, so read trouble code. Alright, now we do have one trouble code in the ABS system. It's got 61-01 battery voltage failure. Um, so it doesn't seem to be serious enough to actually uh, put on the ABS warning light but it is a fault that needs to be looked at so we'll we look at that um, at a later stage just uh, right now showing you that it does communicate with the ABS system so it has found a fault there and then what we'll do is we'll go into the SRS system which is the airbag system it's another important system but again we don't have any airbag light showing on the dashboard just to show you that it can uh, try and pick out any faults if there are any Okay, so we'll go read trouble codes. There we go, no trouble codes on this, so that's good news. Uh, if it was a case where you did have the AB, sorry, the airbag light showing on your dashboard, um, what it would do is it would give you a trouble code with a little description of where the, uh, the fault was, and once it actually fixed that, it would just really be a case of um, sort of scrolling back and erasing the trouble codes just like this here. Uh, TTCs have been cleared. And then it would be a case of actually um, the airbag light being removed from the dashboard. All right, so that's the uh, in a nutshell that is the um, the system, the CarSoft MI6 system. Um, it gives you it gives you different menus for different vehicles depending on what you're diagnosing really. Um, but as I say, I mean that was a Honda vehicle that we diagnosed there. If you go back into the main system again that's the Americas and that's the Asia's again there's more there more there and then you've got your European vehicles so there's an awful lot of vehicle coverage here um, if you are interested in the CarSoft MI6 kit just click the link directly below this video and it will take you to a page directly on our website where you can pick this kit up thanks for watching